Anush. Waalaikum assalam, ma'am. How are you? Fine, ma'am. Say alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Are you ready for the lesson? Yes. All right. Can you read the A'uz and Tasmiya? Yes. Read A'uzu Billahi. A'uzu Billahi. Min ash-shaytu. Min ash-shaytu. Nirrajim. Nirrajim. Bismillah. Bismillah. Hirrahmah. Hirrahmah. Nirrahim. Nirrahim. I seek. I seek. Allah's protection. Allah's protection. From Satan. From Satan. Who is accursed. Who is accursed. In the name of Allah, in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most gracious, the most merciful, the most merciful. Rabbi zidni ilma, Rabbi zidni ilma. O oh Allah, O oh Allah, increase my knowledge, increase my knowledge. Amin. Amin. You're excited for the lesson? Yes. That's great. Shall we start from the Arabic alphabet? Yes. Okay. Today I'm going to write for you some letters we are going to learn. I will use the pink color now and I'm making a straight stroke like that. And this letter is called Alif. Alif. Say it politely. Alif. Alif. Say it once again. Alif. Once again. Alif. Alif. I'm going to use different colors now for you. And you have to tell me what is this starts with A? Alif. Alif. Very good. Now with the yellow color can you tell me what is this? Alif. Alif. Very good. Now with the blue color, can you tell me what is this? Alif. Alif. Well done. Excellent. Shall we move to the next letter now? Yes. Okay. Great. Mashallah. Now you have to tell me this letter. I am going to draw a small ball down and this letter starts with B and you have to read it very politely. Say it. Ba. Ba. Very good. Once again, look, the ball bounces down, right? So there is one small ball down. Ball starts with B and you can pronounce this letter. What is this? Ba. Ba. Very good. Which color shall I use the next one? Mm, the red one. The red one. Okay. So here we go. And now you are going to tell me which letter is this? Ba. And shall we revise the previous letter we did it? What yes. was this? Alif. Alif. Wonderful. Excellent. Mashallah. Now, Anush, we are going to do another letter. That is the brother of the bear. Okay. Ta. Mm, ta. So we are going to put two dots. How many dots are there? Two. Two starts with T. Am I right? Yes. And where are the dots? On the top or bottom? Top. Top also starts with T, right? Yes. So you're going to do this letter with T and you have to be a little airy for this letter and say Ta. Ta. Very good. Now say, tell me with another color. What is this? Ta. Ta. Very good. Now with an other color, Hi. tell me what is this? Ta. Can we revise the previous letters? Yes. What is this? Alif. Very good. And what is this? Ba. Excellent. Now there is one more interesting letter we are going to do, okay? okay? First of all, I'm going to draw a diagram for you. Here are two teeth, right? These yes. are going to be the upper teeth, Anush, okay? okay? And this is the tongue. Okay. This part is called the tip of the tongue, fine? Yes. And we are going to touch the top tip of the tongue on the front teeth edges. And then we are going to pronounce one letter that is called... Fair. Fair. Very good. This much part of your tongue should be outside of your mouth. Touch this part of the tongue on the front teeth edges and say it politely. Fair. Fair. Well done. Can you say it again? I'm so happy you're saying it very nice. Fair. Excellent. Once again. Fair. Very nice. Can you tell me which letter is this? Alice. Which letter is this? Bear. Which letter is this? And finally, this letter, how do we have to pronounce? Excellent, mashallah. Very good. Now I'm going to ask from you the letters over here, okay? Okay. 
Did you like it? Yes, these are ice creams. Okay. Now, can you tell me which letter is this? Elif. Elif. Very good. Now, which letter is this? Ba. Which letter is this? Fa. Oh, is this Fa? Fa. Fa. Be loud a little bit. Fa. Very nice. And then now tell me which letter is this? These are two teeth and this one is the tongue. Can you touch it? Fa. Excellent. Mashallah. Very good. Wonderful. Now, what are we going to do next? We are going to learn other letters. This one, like this. If I go, if I put the dot inside, this letter starts with J. Can you read it? G. G. Very good. Now I'm going to make another letter, and this is empty letter. You have to take out the air from your throat and say it politely. Ha. Ha. Very good. Now I'm going to make another letter, same, similar, the shapes, but the dot, I'm going to put it on the top of it, just like the king crown. And you know the king is always powerful, right? King starts with K. And you have to say this letter in a powerful manner. Say it. Ho. Ho. Very good. Now, do you want stars or not? Stars. Stars, yes. Okay, so repeat the letters now. Which letter is this? Jim. Jim. Nicely say it. Jim. Jim. Now tell me which letter is this? Ha. Ha. Now tell me which letter is this? Ho. Ho. Very nice. Now we are going to do few other letters are you ready for it yes yes i'm going to make a half bended shape letter like that and this letter is called i know del say del, del. and del's brother if i put a dot on it you have to del. yes also try to touch your top tip of the tongue del. on the front teeth edges very good once again say it well, well, excellent. Now we are going to do another letter, a straight stick like this. Then it is going in the bending form like that. Straight, raw. but right, raw. Starts with R, isn't yes. it? Yes. Now the R, brother, you know, it's a kind of a vibrated letter. Zaz. You have to say it. Z. Z. Once again, in a Z. vibration form, say it. Z. Once again, say it. Z. Once again, say it. Z. 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 Excellent. So, raw and raw's brother, what is it called? Z. Z. Once again, what is raw and raw's brother? The raw brother is called? Z. Z. And what is the dal brother? Zell. Okay. Now tell me which letter is this? Zell. Which letter is this? Zell. Which letter is this? Ro. And which letter is this in a vibrated sound? Zell. Once again, Z. Little strictly. Zell. Zell. And this one touch your top tip of the tongue on the front teeth edges? Zell. Zell. Once again, Zell and? Zell. Zell. Ro and? Z. Once again in a vibrated form. Z. Strictly. Very good. Which letter is this, by the way? I forgot. Can you help me? Alif. This is Alif. Very good. Which letter is this? Um, this one. P. Which letter is this? P. Very good. And which letter is this? Starts with B. B. Which letter is this? G. G. Which letter is this? An empty letter. Can you take out the air from your throat? Ha. And the king letter powerful. As if you're cleaning your throat. I want to hear this letter in a powerful Ho. manner. Once again. Ho. Ho. Like that. Ho. Excellent. Now what is Anush going to do the next? Hmm? I like these ice creams. You like it? Yes. I think they are very yummy. Me too. I love it. I love ice creams. 
Now we are going to do a letter which is having a whistle sound. Okay, Anush? Okay. I'm going to make two U's, right? And then a big U like that. And this letter is called seen. Seen. If something is lost, you may ask your mom, right? Mommy, have you seen my pencil? Have you seen my notebook? Right? Yes. It's just like that one. Seen. Little whistle sound. Seen. Yes. Once again, can you say it? See. Let's do a magic with this letter now. I am going to place some dots on the top, right? And they are, yes, they are becoming noisy as if you are going to ask someone to be quiet. Shh, like that. Shush letter. So it is called She. Well done. Sheen is so happy from you. It's glad. Now he's saying that Anush is reading me very nice. Say it again. Seen. Seen. Sheen. Sheen. Very nice. Now we are going to do another letter that is called Sod. Sod. Once again, Sod is also a name, right? Yes. It's a boy name or girl name? Boy. Boy. Okay. So we are going to place A A D, Ad, like a surname. Okay. This letter is called Sod. So we will place S over here. Fine. Okay. If I'm going to place a dot now on the top of it on Saad's brother, right? So this <coughs> will change into D. What will it become now? Dot. Dot. Very nice. Say it once again. Dot. Once again. Dot. So it is Saad and Dot. Saad and Dot. Well done. Saad and Dot are done. Now, can we try to do some other letter? Yes. Okay. After saw the dot, we are going to try now one letter who spells in English like the same one. For example, T double A, Ta. You did ta. one. This one. You know Ta? Yeah. Ta eats only two roti. No, no, no. Ta eats only. Only two ice creams. No two ice creams. Ta it's only one thing, like you can say just a banana to survive. Okay? Okay. Ta eats one banana only, and there is going to be a big giant letter who spells the same in English, right? With T. Va. No, this is going to be Va. Can you bold? The letter, please. Can you make your mouth round and read it in a fatty way manner? Man, it is a bold letter. Yes, this is a bold letter. Now say it. Po. Po. Well done. Once again, po. Po. So what's the difference? This letter eats a lot, brings juice, takes hamburgers, mm -hmm. eats lots of things, right? So this letter is a heavy letter. You have to say it. Oh, bold letter. To. And this one is polite. Te. Te and to. Te, Te and to. to. Very good. Now, if we are going to do the same letter, to, if I'll place a dot on top of it, right? You so. Yes, you also have to touch your top tip of the tongue on the no. front tip edges and try to bold the letter because this is similar just like the to brother they both are fatty right vo vo yes blow your cheeks say it vo vo excellent once again can you tell me which letter is this vo there is no dot over here this one to to very good now you have to tell me which letter is the other one the to's brother Zo. Excellent. Zo. To and Zo are done. And which one shall I use it? Is this one good for you, balloons? Do you yes. like it? Yes. Yes. Okay. I'm going to draw one small C K letter, right? And then I'm going to join with it a big K C letter like that. And this letter is called in Arabic. Ain, you have to say it sharply. Ain, no, ain, not in two steps. You have to say it. 
Ain. Ain. Yes. Open your mouth and try to close it. Ain. Ain. Once again, sharply say it. Ain. Ain. And on Ain, if I'm going to place a dot, it will become Ain. Ain. Very good. So I'm going to say like that. Ain. Ain. And then Ain. Ain. We can omit one A from it, right? So it is. It will be like that. Ain. Ain. Very nice. Now you have to tell me this letter starts with F. I guess you know this one. Fair. Fair. And if I'm going to make another circle, but I'll draw a line down and I'll turn it round like that. And I'll place two doors on the top. This letter starts with Q and you have to say it off. Off. So this is fair. Fair. Off. Off. You know the other letter? Just like the off spelling, if I'm going to write it Q, double A, and F, right? Yes. The same smarter one, double A, F, I'm going to write another letter like this. This starts with K. It's an A-D letter. You have to read it politely. Say K. K. Very good. So difference between the off and the cap is this. The off is polite or bold? Bold. Very good. And this calf is polite or bold? Polite. Polite. Very good. So one is off. One is off. And the other one is calf. And the other one is calf. Very good. Ain, roin. Ain, roin. Say ain quickly. Ain, roin. Roin. Fair. Fair. Off. Off. Calf. Calf. When it's raining and you have to go out, what do you do? Take umbrella. Umbrella, right. Can we draw an umbrella? Yes. I'll just quickly draw it for you. Okay. Like that, like that, like that. Now, do you know what? Where is the stick of umbrella? Over down here. over here. So look at the shape of the umbrella. Alif. No, like alif. It's turning towards like this. If it is cut it, then it is alif. But I'm turning the shape like that. So this is in Arabic. It's called lamb. Lamb. The opposite shape of this stick. If it turns towards like that, so it's l l sound in English, right? So this is called. Lamb. Lamb. Say it nicely again. Lamb wants to smile with you. Lamb. Lamb wants to, wants to be your friend now. Once again, look. Lamb. Lamb. Just like the umbrella stick, right? Stick like that and turns like this. Lamb. Lamb. Now, very easy letter. Like a mummy's M, okay? I'm going to make a circle, then a straight line, and it drops down. Me. Me. So, Meme is also happy smiling. Can you say it again? Meme. Meme. Okay. So, lamb and meme are easy? Yes. Okay. When in the morning time, how do you greet everyone? You say good morning, right? Yes. But later on, when the sun rises up high in the daytime, right? So, it's no more the morning now. Then it is going to be the good evening. No, it's going to be good afternoon. Good afternoon. Once again, say it. Good afternoon. Good after noon. Noon. So it's the noon time. That's why, right? Shall I draw a noon letter for you? It is yes. also in Arabic noon, like this. A small dot inside. Okay. Now say. What is this? Noon. Noon. Which letter is this? Noon. Noon. In the daytime, what do you? How do you greet everyone? Good. Good morning. Is it good morning? Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Very good. Now say it again. Good afternoon. Okay. So which letter is this then? Noon. Noon. Very good. Once again, say. It. Good afternoon. Okay, tell me which letter is this? Noon. Noon. Excellent. So, lamb, meme, and noon. Don't forget it, okay? Okay. If somebody comes and gives you some surprise, for example, some candies. Wow. Like that. So, when you are excited, what do you say? 
What do you say? Wow. wow. So there is an Arabic letter also. It's turning round like that. The way you are saying wow, you're turning your lips round. This letter is called in Arabic. Wow. Wow. Very good. Can you say wow again? Wow. Okay. Which letter was this just like the umbrella stick? Lamb. Lamb. Which letter is this starts with M? Me. Me. Very good. Okay, now after me, which letter is this, Anoush? No. Okay, and which letter is this? Wow. Wow, very good. Wow, I'm surprised. Wow, mashallah. Good. Okay, now we are going to do a letter. This one, if you remember, an empty letter starts with H? Yes. Which letter is this? Ha. Ha. Now we are going to do another letter. It spells the same. Hamza. No. It spells the same, but we have to read it deeply. Yeah. Ha. Very good. Deeply from the last part of the throat. For example, this is your face, right? This is the first part. This is the second part. This is the last part. From there, you have to pronounce it deeply. Ha. Ha. Once again. Ha. 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 Very good. Now we are going to do the Hamza letter, okay? Hamza is also a boy name, right? Like the sword. Hamza. Say it. Hamza. Hamza. So when somebody says to you something and you say, yes, yes, I know it. Yeah, yeah, I know it, right? So that yeah, there is a letter in Arabic. This is called yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Once again, say it. Which letter is this? Yeah. Once again, tell me which letter is this? Yeah. Okay, repeat the letters. Which letter is this? Lamb. Lamb. Which letter is this? Neem. Which letter is this? Noon. Which letter is this? Wow. Very good. Which letter is this? He. <laughs> Deeply. Very good. Which letter is this? Hamza. Which letter is this? Yeah. Mashallah. Very nice. Excellent. Mashallah. Very good. So, thank you for the lesson, Anoush. And inshallah, in the next class, we are going to repeat our Arabic alphabets. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Allah Hafiz. Allah Hafiz.